When I grow up, I'll find somebody just like my mom, somebody who spoils me. Well, that's not healthy. Says you. <laughs> if somebody wanted to buy you stuff and support you, would you say no? <laughs> you think someone like that would respect you? Oh, well, she respects me. If not, I'll just act out until she does. Hearing this little boy talking about some, I want somebody just like my mom. And I'm just in here like. <laughs> What's wrong with your nose? I tried to help my mommy, but I couldn't save her. He hit her. Was that your dad? No, he died. I don't remember him at all. I'm never going to make the mistakes she made. I'm going to stay in control for everything. All right. What's your name, young lady? Hazel. And what's your name, young man? Devon. Hazel, how you feeling? Yeah, that's crazy. This is the timeline of how it happened and why that makes me think that way towards men now. The problems we tried to solve as kids are the same problems we're trying to solve as adults. Devon, how was it hearing little Devon tell your story over here? Like you said, he's blessed, because there's nothing wrong with getting everything given to you. It's all about how you take that down the line. I don't think Davon really got the real lesson out of this drill. I feel like everything that little Davon was saying, he was like validating, like, yeah, I know I'm supposed to get what I want. Did that little kid feel like he deserved to have everything being given to him like that? Yeah, I don't see why I shouldn't. So why do you sometimes act like you don't? I guess because I'm so used to always getting my way that when I don't, then I don't know how to react.